hello and welcome to this tutorial in this tutorial i'll show you how to design the simple model from startcad cam site okay and this will be a practical exercise that we'll do in freecad so now let's go to freecad and what you'll do in the start page here is to create a new document and here select part design workbench and next create board and create a new sketch this sketch here will create in um, xy plane so we select this xy plane here and next here we'll select this slot tool click in this line here and next in this line again and next here we'll set we'll constrain this slot so we select this math constraint and now select these two center points and this vertical line okay and what to do next is to set the dimension for the slot so here we have this dimension here 100 for the center of these slots and here we have a range of 19 so first here we select this constraint here and we constrain the range of this arc here to 19 and next we select this horizontal distance tool select this line here and we'll set 100 okay and next here we'll create these cycles so what to do is to select the cycle tool and create the cycle in this center point here and now we'll constrain the red the diameter of the cycle to here we see 16 millimeters okay and next we select this cycle and we go to this copy option and Click in this point now and now leave this sketch and press on go to pad tool here I'll set a pad of 25 millimeters so here I'll change the link to 25 okay and click OK and next here we'll create this part here so what to do is to go to we create a new sketch here we select exit plane okay in this sketch we'll create this arc here okay so switch to section view and now select this arc tool click in this origin point and now in this horizontal line and again in this horizontal line and now draw a line in these two points here okay and next here we select this origin point and this point here and horizontal constraint sorry here we select this point and this point horizontal constraint and next here we'll set the radius of this arc here so we select this constraint and now this arc and here we'll set the radius of 40 okay so now leave this sketch here and now select this pad tool smart to plane and the link here will be will be 60 okay so you set 60 and okay and now what we'll do is to create this part here so here we'll create a new sketch in xy plane switch to section view and now select this center rectangle tool and here we draw this rectangle okay and next here we'll set the dimension of this rectangle so here we have a vertical distance of 40 and this distance here this dimension here 50. so we select this horizontal distance tool here we'll set 50 and now for this line we set 40 okay and next leave this sketch here and we go to pad tool and the length of this pad here we can see in the string page we have 45 here so we'll set this dimension and okay and now we have this and next here we go to this pad operation click in this arrow and copy the sketch here or we can create a new sketch in this space here and and here we'll draw 
a centered rectangle okay and next here we'll extract this edge and next we'll set the distance here so the horizontal dimension here is we can see in this top view we have this dimension 5 so here we'll set 5 millimeters and the vertical distance is 5 millimeters and now leave this sketch here and go to pocket tool the length of this pocket we can see here is 5 millimeters so change here to 5 and ok and next here we'll create this pocket ok so what to do is to select this face here and create a new sketch and now we select this rectangle tool and we draw this rectangle and next we we'll select this arc tool click in this origin point and now in this line here and next click again this line and next here select this trim tool and trim this line here and now we have the sketch okay so next here we'll set the dimension for this sketch here so here we see a range of we see this dimension here for the range of this arc here so we select this tool and we set the radius and for the and here we see this horizontal dimension 68 so we select this horizontal distance tool and for this line we set 68 okay and we have this vertical dimension here for this vertical line here so we select this vertical distance tool and now this line here and we set 6 millimeters okay and now select this constraint here we constrain these lines and now these two points here and now what to do is to drag this point here and now select this point and this origin point and now horizontal constraint and now we select this equal constraint here and we select this line and this line here and you can see that the sketch is full constrained so leave the sketch here and now go to pocket tool here we set triangle okay so click okay and next here we'll create this wall here so what to do here is to here we go to these filters here and click in this arrow and select this cylinder here and first here what to do is to select this face and now go to and now select this initial CS option and flip sides and next you will set the radius and the height of this cylinder so here we have a diameter of 12 so the radius here will be 6 and the height here will we can set 7 and ok so now we have this wall here so as you can see we finished the design of this model here thank you for watching this video if you like this video please leave a like okay